Hi folks, this is all the fruit, and here I have Montingia calabura, or the Panama berry. I'm on the island of Tenerife, and I, I've known the Panama berry from Southeast Asia. There it's a popular, well, roadside tree. They plant it in the cities. It also escapes. It's kind of invasive. The children eat it everywhere. It's like the little red berry the children basically eat everywhere throughout Southeast Asia. It's basically like our cherries. However, here in Tenerife, the plant looks a bit different. It's a lot more massive. Well, the tree itself it's, is small. It looks like maybe the original stem died back and those and a kind of a shrub-like thing grew back from the, uh, from the roots. But look at that. Thick, big leaves. Quite massive flowers, most important of all, quite big fruit. Those are like over one and a half centimeters in diameter, while the fruit I found throughout Southeast Asia were smaller. They were all under a centimeter. Look at the size of those fruits. They're basically the size of cherries. Hmm. Taste wise, yeah, they are nice. Maybe not as sweet as them. Fruit I found in, let's say, mm, then the fruit I, I found in Cambodia, also in Cambodia, uh, although in Cambodia I found them in the dry season. Well, here it's winter now. When I tried the same fruit in Java, and other parts of Indonesia in the rainy season, it wasn't very sweet. Well, here you can see the numerous little seeds. I hope you can see them. The numerous little seeds inside the fruit. Here there are a couple of them on my fingers. I hope you can see them. They are really tiny. Here are some more. What I don't like about those big fruit is that the skin is quite tough kind of spoils the fun, basically. Hmm. The ones in Southeast Asia, you could pop them in your mouth and basically chew a bit and swallow them. However, the ones here, phew, I really spit out the skin because it's too, it's just too tough. To be honest, folks, I prefer the teeny tiny ones I found in Cambodia to those here. Those might be bigger, but the skin is also thicker, so nope, I don't like this. Look at that. I cannot, I don't understand if this is what they planted of the, or if those are some suckers. And also it looks like they kind of bulldoze the plant because look, the roots are like half out of the ground. Very strange. Well, folks, this was the Panama berry, or Kerson, Montingia calabura, a tasty little fruit you can find in many tropical cities growing along the stretch. Mmm, really tasty, but this tough skin on this variety, yeah, it's just too much. Well, folks, stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos on the beautiful island of Tenerife. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe.